I'm only 13 and I almost have 3,000 followers. Ava wants to be a social media star, just like her hero, self-proclaimed Beverly Hills brat, Nicolette Gray. She recently defended her lifestyle choice and staggering allowance, which got as high as $5,000 a month, on the Dr. Phil Show. I know I'm a spoiled brat, but I enjoy the lifestyle, you know? People are gonna hate on me, but they wish they were me. So today, we've decided to put a what would you do spin on this story. Ava is more than a social media wannabe. She's also a rude and obnoxious shopper. Honey, this bag is so hot. All of your friends are gonna be so jealous. <laughs> there you go. Ew, that is not my style. Go get me something cute. Okay, miss, I'll be right back. We have a lot of money to spend here. You'd think that stupid worker would get it right. You're in a clothing store when suddenly you spot her, a bratty, bossy teen who's being incredibly rude and disrespectful. Do you let her shop away and continue with her ugly insults? Or do you step in and tell this little diva she's a fashion don't? Uh, excuse me. Get out of my shot. What would you do? Why is everyone in this store so annoying? Ugh! We're rolling at Urban Club, a popular and trendy boutique in Wayne, New Jersey. These aren't cool enough. I need, like... Oh, oh, I'm sure I can find something. And Ava is taking being bratty... Gosh, she has no idea. ...to the extreme. So, what about these? No. Then you have... This is cute. I found awesome stuff here before. You're just bringing me junk. Ava's rude behavior has the attention of to... this woman. Kids want to be Instagram famous, like me. I think people should have better taste in the store. And with that, she's pacing around the store. She's just circling around her. So maybe a dress? This is cute. Oh, no. You have a completely different style than me. She alerts the store's owner, who's also working with us. You should just listen. It feels uncomfortable to me. All right. Thank you so much for telling yeah. me. Yeah. But as Ava continues... Tracy brings out a shirt and she throws it back at her. This is horrible. You don't know what you're doing. She decides to handle the situation herself. Sweetheart, you got to calm down. She's working here. She's doing her best for you. It's just not good enough. I'm sorry. It's not. You're entitled, but she works here and does not deserve to be treated this way. I honestly don't know why you got involved. When I see somebody acting unkind, I feel like I need to say something. <sighs> Time for us to let her know she's been heard. Well, you had to say something, huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what were you thinking? I mean, I just felt terrible for the woman who was working here. And I, you know, we, we want to make sure that we're raising empowered girls to speak truth, but not to mistreat people. But now that mistreatment continues. Oof, that's so last year. I'd never wear that. Don't you have anything else that's cuter? This mother decides to engage with Ava. How old are you? 13. You're 13? <laughs> we're all 13. That's like fun. Fun. I mean, the workers here just don't know what they're doing. <laughs> what are you looking for? Something that'll make me look nice. Like she can't find anything cool. What, what's cool? Point to her own outfit. What I'm wearing. Like I put this together step by step. <laughs> so I have these. Okay, no. I don't oh. like camo. I'm not a camo. Oh, you're girl. not a camo. Oh. Yeah, that's a problem. That's horrible. You could definitely do better. Her calm turns to disgust. And on her way out, she lets Ava's mom have it. My daughter snapped at someone or rolled her eyes. I can promise you she wouldn't do it twice. Ava's mom makes it clear she's enabling her devilish daughter. Well, I told her to expect the very best. I'm a mom. We all do the best we can. We, we do what we think is right. And I definitely wouldn't let my daughter stand with her hand like this and her eyes rolling at a grown-up. That wouldn't happen either. Well... <laughs> <laughs> um, just when your daughter is 15 and tells you to go f you'll know why. Maybe you just don't understand fashion like we do. Clearly not, and that's not my priority. But you know what is my priority? A little girl who knows how to act. Time to tell her it's all been an act. Ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Social media has changed the way we interact with people. Absolutely. And we see these little girls taking on these adult personas, these adult mannerisms, and they're rude and they're, you know, it's some of it is parenting and some of it really just is an immaturity. I don't want to listen to a little girl act like a <laughs> sorry. I don't. No, 
No. Throughout the day, many other shoppers feel the same. Who's your boss? This woman is in disbelief. Some step in by supporting our worker. It looks cheap. Looks like what the poor kids would wear. And this teacher attempts to teach her a lesson. Just trying to help you out. You don't have to be rude. Hi there. How are you? Oh my God! Stop it! <laughs> I'm gonna cry because when I heard her say this stuff's for the poor kids, mm -hmm. I almost walked out. Our last shopper of the day. Oh, I have the same sunglasses. <laughs> She's a teen herself. Can you take a picture of me so I could add to Instagram? I'm oh, sure. Thank you so much. I love it. You're welcome. And she quickly befriends the polite Ava. How old are you? 13. Cool. Oh, that is cute. But cute little Ava. Oh my gosh, no way. <laughs> is about to show her true colors. Not for me. Not for me. So, do you like something like this? No. And now oh. Jessica Goldman has changed from friend to foe. You can't do that. This isn't your house. I deserve the best. This is your mom's. Right there. Now she's about to find out where Ava gets all that mom attitude. Yes, honey. She's throwing clothes all over the ground. It's okay. This woman's an idiot. She's not helping you? No. She's not an idiot. We don't have a budget. This doesn't have anything to do with throwing clothes on the ground. Well, that's so disrespectful. I'm literally shaking you know, right now. That's so rude. You know, we're going to spend a lot of money here right now, and that's kind of a part of what they do. Oh, my God. I'm literally going to cry. She's just a worker. So then leave if you don't like anything here. Don't be rude to people. Be nice. There's no reason to be mean. And as Ava storms out, I'm done. I'm out of here. This young woman isn't afraid to give our mom some parenting tips. You really need to teach your daughter better manners. Like, I'm sorry I don't mean to tell you how to parent, but that was extremely rude, and she made everyone uncomfortable in here. I teach her that she can have whatever she I wants. If I talk like that to an adult, I think my mom would kick me out of the house. Great, great. We'll break it. Why are you so upset? You shouldn't be getting involved. Because you're disrespecting people that I know create good service. How are you? <laughs> oh, my God. My heart is beating so fast. Bless your heart. You're beautiful. <laughs> that was beautiful. You're okay. I'm sorry. Yeah, I just thought that was real. It happens, you know? Why did it touch you so much? Because these people are so nice. I love all of them. They're my family friends and stuff, and like my mom's friends with them, and they're not mean. But something tells me even if you didn't know the store owners, you would still. Yeah, because I hate when people disrespect people who are like helping them and serving them, and just seeing her be so mean to them made me so upset. She wanted more followers. She wanted to look cool. <sighs> yeah, yeah, that wasn't cool. It definitely wasn't cool. And, and of course, you know the owner, right? Yeah. She, she yeah. Was the Thank you so much. You are amazing. Oh my Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.